Hello, sports fan. This is Stephen Hill for Sports Choice Plus. I'm bringing you a very special breakdown. I'm going to be covering the New Orleans Saints taking on the Philadelphia Eagles. Before I get right into that, I'm going to make sure you're subscribed to the YouTube channel so you can get all the updates each and every time we have breakdowns here at Sports Choice Plus. Without further ado, let's get right into the action. Looking at this game, you're looking at how the Tennessee Titans came in and they literally they gave the Saints a tough game. They gave the Saints a tough game. The Saints gave it all they, they had and it was not good enough to beat the Tennessee Titans. And you're looking just at the Philadelphia Eagles. They went and made a statement game against the Denver Broncos. And Jalen Hurts balled out. The, the offense for the Eagles balled out. And you're starting to see this offense for the Eagles come together. The young players are starting to build. And they're starting to get camaraderie. They're starting to gel. In this offense, it's a big timing-based offense. When everybody's running their routes, when everybody's hitting on all cylinders, this offense goes to another level. And you see they lost... Um, Literally, Ertz, and, and Ertz was a key piece of the offense, but I think that now they're playing a little bit more looser. You have guys playing more of their natural positions now. You Now you're looking at Jalen Hurts having to go to other guys, and once they get the ball in their hands, they can make plays. They're playmakers, naturally. So once they get that extra vote of confidence by getting – three or four catches early on in the third or fourth quarter it's over with you can't do anything with them because they've already gotten the ball three or four times they already hit a couple of juke moves got a little sweat going and now they feel like they can beat the guy in front of them and it's hit your head on the goal post time in this game here you got to keep in mind Jameis winston is not the quarterback so whoever you have think of this philly as, as a game where you can attack the quarterback from different spots. You don't have to just blitz from the uh, defensive line. You can blitz from the linebacker position. You can blitz from the corner position. The quarterbacks that they have for the Saints are not the most accurate. They're not the most talented quarterbacks as far as that. If they put Hill in there, you have to watch for the run game, though. You have to watch for the threat that he has with his legs. But overall, Philly has the advantage in a lot of different areas. If Alvin Kamara is healthy, then that may be a different story. But then you got to think of Mark Ingram. They were not able to get the the ground game going like they normally wanted to with the Saints because Alvin Kamara is just not there right now. His knee injury is really holding him back from being on the field. And you look at Philly, you want to hit the gas pedal. From the time that you hit the gas pedal, from the clock starts to the end of the game, you want to make sure the Saints understand your offense is going to dictate the whole entire day. Your offensive line is a better offensive line than Saints right now because just look at the way that the firepower on offense is happening. Defensively, you're playing opportunistic. You're getting the plays that you want. You're taking the gambles and you're getting the turnovers. You're getting the uh, the, the third down and short stops. So if I'm Philly, I'm excited. I think they continue their winning ways this week. I know that the momentum from beating the Broncos is pretty good, and they're going to keep going, and they're going to beat the New Orleans Saints this week. I'm calling that pick, and I think that the Saints just don't have enough on the offensive side or defensive side right now to get it done. I think that when Jameis Winston went down, a lot of their chances of making the playoffs went down as well. So, all you Saints fans, I'm picking you to lose. Sorry. All you Eagles fans, let's go Eagles. E-A-G-L-E-S, Eagles. Definitely get in the comment section and go back and forth with that. Uh, definitely check out all all of our videos, every single week that we have videos here at Sports Choice Plus. And as always, like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you on the next video.